This is Unit Two of Pimsleur's Speak and Read Essential Dutch. The same American has finally found Ms. Jansen. Listen. Luisteren. Pardon. Ja. Bent u mevrouw Jansen? Ja zeker. Ik ben D. Jansen. En u? U bent meneer Daniels? Ja, ik heet Patrick Daniels. U bent Amerikaan? Ja, Amerikaan. In this conversation, you heard the word mijn heer. This means Mr. in Dutch. Listen again. Pardon. Ja. Bent u mevrouw Jansen? Ja zeker. Ik ben D. Jansen. En u? U bent meneer Daniels? Ja, ik heet Patrick Daniels. U bent Amerikaan? Ja, Amerikaan. Do you remember how to say "excuse me" in Dutch? Pardon. Pardon. How do you ask? Are you Ms. Jansen? Bent u mevrouw Jansen? Bent u mevrouw Jansen? Answer: Yes. Ja. Ja. To make her response more emphatic, Ms. Jansen says, "Yes, that's right." Listen. Luisteren. Ja, zeker. Zeker. Literally means certainly. Now you say certainly or that's right. Zeker. Zeker. Say yes, that's right. Ja, zeker. Ja, zeker. Ask again. Are you Miss Jansen? Bent u mevrouw Jansen? Bent u mevrouw Jansen? Yes, that's right. Ja, zeker. Ja, zeker. I am D. Jansen. Listen and repeat. Ik ben D. Jansen. Ik ben D. Jansen. How do you say the name D? D. D. And how do you say my name is Jansen? Mijn naam is Jansen. Mijn naam is Jansen. Suppose someone addresses you by the wrong name. How would you say my name is not Van Houten? Mijn naam is niet van Houten. Mijn naam is niet van Houten. Here's another common way of saying my name is. Listen and repeat. Ik heet. 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 Ik heet. The phrase ik heet has no direct equivalent in English. It means I am called. Repeat once more this way of saying my name is. Ik heet. Ik heet. How would you say my name is Jansen using the expression you have just learned? Ik heet Jansen. Ik heet Jansen. And how do you say my name is not Van Houten? Note that there are two ways of saying this. Mijn naam is niet Van Houten. Ik heet niet Van Houten. Now say, excuse me, Miss Jansen. Pardon, mevrouw Jansen. Pardon, mevrouw Jansen. Ask, excuse me, are you Miss Jansen? Pardon, bent u mevrouw Jansen? Pardon, bent u mevrouw Jansen? This is the right person. She says, "Yes, certainly," or, "Yes, that's right." Say this. Ja, zeker. 
Ja, zeker. My name is D. Janssen. Mijn naam is D. Janssen. Ik heet D. Janssen. And I am Mr. Daniels. Luisteren. En ik ben meneer Daniels. Here's the word for Mr. Listen and repeat. Meneer. Meneer. Repeat one more time, making your pronunciation sound just like the speaker's. Meneer. Meneer. Now you say the Dutch word for Mr. Meneer. Meneer. Do you remember how to say I am? Ik ben. Ik ben. Say I am Mr. Daniels. Ik ben meneer Daniels. Ik ben meneer Daniels. Here's and in Dutch. Listen and repeat. En. En. Say and. En. En. Say and I am Mr. Daniels. En ik ben meneer Daniels. En ik ben meneer Daniels. My name is Daniels. Mijn naam is Daniels. Ik heet Daniels. Now suppose the other person did not quite catch your name. Here's how she would ask you to repeat it. Luisteren. Wat zegt u? She's literally asking, what say you? Here is the word for what. Listen and repeat. Wat. Wat. Here's the word which means say or are saying. Listen and repeat. Zegt. Zegt. Pay careful attention to the ending. It's a combination of the ending of dag followed by a T sound. Repeat again the word for say or are saying. Zegt. Zegt. Repeat the whole question. What are you saying? Wat zegt u? Wat zegt u? This question might seem abrupt to an American, but it's perfectly polite in Dutch. During your stay in the Netherlands, you'll notice very quickly that the Dutch have a manner of speaking that may surprise you with its directness. Now you ask, what are you saying, to indicate that you would like the other person to repeat. Wat zegt u? Wat zegt u? Answer, my name is Daniels. My name is Daniels. Ik heet Daniels. Ask again. Are you Ms. Janssen? Bent u mevrouw Janssen? Bent u mevrouw Janssen? Answer for her. Yes. Ja. Yeah. Ja. Yeah. Say... Yes, that's right. Ja, zeker. Ja, zeker. She then says something that you don't understand. How would you get her to repeat what she said? Wat zegt u? Wat zegt u? She repeats, but she says it too fast for you. You want to tell her that she's speaking very fast. Luisteren. U spreekt heel vlug. Repeat the Dutch word for fast. Vlug. Vlug. How do you say fast? 
Vlug. Vlug. Very fast. Here's very in Dutch. Listen and repeat. Heel. Heel. Say very. Heel. Heel. Very fast. Heel vlug. Heel vlug. You speak very fast. Luisteren. U spreekt heel vlug. Here's you speak or you are speaking. Listen and repeat. U spreekt. U spreekt. Which part means speak? Spreekt. Spreekt. Say again, you speak. U spreekt. U spreekt. Very fast. Heel vlug. Heel vlug. You speak very fast. U spreekt heel vlug. U spreekt heel vlug. How would the other person say, Oh, excuse me. Oh, pardon. Oh, pardon. Say, you are speaking fast. U spreekt vlug. U spreekt vlug. Very fast. Heel vlug. Heel vlug. Excuse me, you are speaking very fast. Pardon, u spreekt heel vlug. Pardon, u spreekt heel vlug. Here is how you would say, I speak, or I am speaking. Listen and repeat. Ik spreek. Ik spreek. Listen to the word speak, as in, I speak. Luister. Spreek. Spreek. Say, I speak. Ik spreek. Ik spreek. And now say, you speak. U spreekt. U spreekt. Say, you speak very fast. U spreekt heel vlug. U spreekt heel vlug. Say, excuse me, Mr. Daniels. Pardon, meneer Daniels. Pardon, meneer Daniels. Say, no offense. Dat geeft niet hoor. Dat geeft niet hoor. Ms. Jansen asks you, are you an American? Luisteren. Bent u Amerikaan? Here's the word for an American, referring to a man. Listen and repeat. Kaan. Kaan. Amerikaan. Amerikaan. Note that in Dutch, an is understood. Now you say an American, referring to a man. Amerikaan. Amerikaan. How would you ask Mr. Daniels if he is an American? Bent u Amerikaan, meneer Daniels? Bent u Amerikaan, meneer Daniels? How would he answer, yes, that's right? Jazeker. Jazeker. 
an American. 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 Here's how you would ask a woman if she is an American. Listen carefully to the ending of the word and repeat. Bent u Amerikaanse? Se. Amerikaanse. Bent u Amerikaanse? How do you say an American referring to a woman? Amerikaanse. Amerikaanse. Say, I am an American. Say it first for a man, then for a woman. Ik ben Amerikaan. Ik ben Amerikaanse. Now, suppose you didn't understand the other person's next question. What would you be likely to say? Wat zegt u? Wat zegt u? Say, you are speaking very fast. U spreekt heel vlug. U spreekt heel vlug. Too fast. Listen and repeat. Te vlug. Te vlug. Which word means too? Te. Te. Say again, too fast. Te vlug. Te vlug. You are speaking too fast. U spreekt te vlug. U spreekt te vlug. How would you ask, do I speak too fast? Spreek ik te vlug? Spreek ik te vlug? Is that too fast? Listen and repeat. Is dat te vlug? Is dat te vlug? Which word means that? Dat. Dat. Is that too fast? Is dat te vlug? Is dat te vlug? No, that is fine. Luisteren. Nee, dat is goed. What is the word for fine or good? Goed. Goed. Say, that is fine, or that is good. Dat is goed. Dat is goed. And do you remember how to say, that doesn't matter? Dat geeft niet hoor. Dat geeft niet hoor. How do you say, I'm an American. Say both male and female. Ik ben Amerikaan. Ik ben Amerikaanse. And how do you indicate that you didn't understand what the other person said? Wat zegt u? Wat zegt u? Say... You're speaking too fast. U spreekt te vlug. U spreekt te vlug. And say, that's fine. Dat is goed. Dat is goed. Now, let's review. How would you greet a man in the Netherlands or Belgium? Dag meneer. And how would you greet a woman? Dag mevrouw. Ask, are you Mrs. Van der Poel? Bent u mevrouw van der Poel? Say, yes, that's right. Jazeker. And how would you say, no, my name is not Van der Poel? 
Nee, mijn naam is niet Van der Pol. Nee, ik heet niet Van der Pol. Excuse yourself. Pardon. Say no offense. Dat geeft niet hoor. Say that you are Ms. Van Houten. Ik ben mevrouw Van Houten. Now, tell me your name is Johnston. Mijn naam is Johnston. Ik heet Johnston. And how do you say, I'm Mr. Johnston? Ik ben meneer Johnston. Tell me your name is not Smith. Mijn naam is niet Smith. Ik heet niet Smith. How would you say that you are an American? Say both male and female. Ik ben Amerikaan. Ik ben Amerikaanse. Now, tell me that I'm speaking very fast. U spreekt heel vlug. And how would you say, I speak too fast? Ik spreek te vlug. Now ask, do I speak too fast? Spreek ik te vlug? Say, no, that's fine. Nee, dat is goed. Respond, goodbye. Tot ziens. Now suppose you're in your hotel lobby and you see someone you think you recognize. Say, excuse me. Pardon. Ask, are you Mrs. Drost? Bent u mevrouw Drost, hè? How would she answer, yes, that's right, my name is Drost. Jazeker, mijn naam is Drosten. Jazeker, ik heet Drosten. She then says something you don't understand. How would you ask her to repeat? Wat zegt u? Tell her she is speaking too fast. U spreekt te vlug. How would she excuse herself? Pardon. Say, that doesn't matter. Dat geeft niet hoor. Now say, goodbye Mrs. Drost. Tot ziens mevrouw Drosten. Say goodbye for her. Dag. You are now ready to do the reading lesson with this unit. If necessary, stop the tape and get your reading booklet. Open it to the page for unit 2. Proceed when you're ready. Listen to the first word and repeat after the speaker. Ben. The short E eh sound resembles the E in the English word let. Now read number 1 again. Ben. Read number two. Bent. Three. Het staat. Number four. Aan hem. Read number five. Het. Now look at number six. The E in te is unstressed and resembles an a uh sound. Read six. Te hoog. Seven. Me. Number eight has a long A sound that resembles the one in the English word bane. Read eight. Aim. 
Number nine. Heeft. Read ten. Heeft. Eleven. Eight. Look at twelve. The first e is long, and the e n ending is unstressed. It resembles an a、uh、sound. Read number twelve aloud. Mena. Look at number thirteen. It has a short i sound that resembles the one in the English word hit. Read thirteen. Bit. Fourteen. Dick. Look at fifteen. The Dutch s has a hissing sound, as in the English word miss. Read fifteen. Is. Read sixteen aloud. Miss. Seventeen has an e sound, but it's short and clipped. Read seventeen. Beat. Read eighteen. Het geeft niet. Close your reading booklet and put it aside. This is the end of unit two.